You know when you're in your house and you're under strict rules and then you leave your house and then like you're a completely different person. You know like some women when they want to go out they put on their trousers and that and then they leave the house and put the skirts up here. You've got to be the same person in the gym as you are outside the gym, do you know what I mean? So you can't be in the gym saying, yeah coach, I'm going to do my press ups, I'm going to patch the bag, then on the way home you stop off for a McDonald's. Do you know what I mean? So you've got to be disciplined. And I think, probably the reason why I don't get too caught up in the hype is because, like, remember I wasn't boxing from when I was 12, so like Frankie, like, I know Frankie as a boxer from a young kid. I, was, I wasn't that young kid. So when I started boxing, like, no one really believed in what I was doing. Like, sneaking under, like trying to sneak under the table to not pay my subs. Do you know what I mean? Um, my cousin borrowed me some boots because there was no dough to buy boots. I used to throw up on the, about four times on the way home, have headaches. So you've got to believe in your dream when no one cares, like no one cared. Um, and I think now people are interested, you've got to keep it level-headed because if I was to let that, like I failed as well, I've lost as an amateur, so if you lose, keep on going, believe in your dream and don't give up. It's all about you, it's no one else, this is all about you, so stay dedicated. Yeah, thank you.